Last time we played, I did a lot of things. I ran all over the map, did a lot of stuff underground, did some story in Gerudo Town, did some, well, side quests out there, did some side quests in Terrytown and also in, uh, what's it called? All oh, the kids are asleep. In Zora's Domain. Uh, I know I need to buy some arrows. I will always run out of them. Mm. Okay. I think without... F oh, wait. I never found how to get the... The little th thing underground over here underground the i'll have to look up how to get the the little munchkin fella uh, i could be nice and take that lady on uh a sand seal to the seven heroine statue let's talk to her Hey, you look like you've done your fair share of exploring. I lost my map. Does that sound familiar? Take me there on a sleigh seal. In that case, I'll wait for you. Come talk to me once you got a sleigh seal ready. Sleigh. Big sleigh. I need that waistband apron with the sand seal on it. It's so adorable! I'll rent one. Slay, mama. It's never not slay. Happy Pride last weekend to those in New York City and San Francisco and probably other places around the country. Hey, Pokey, yeah. I see you prepared to slay. Is it okay for me to hop on? Oh, all right, let's get going relatively safely if possible. Are they gonna, like, send people after me? You know they, they'll totally just straight up do that. Anyways, let me put a marker here just so I can, for the most part, not get entirely lost. I think a straight shot is okay. Hey. See, like, she's not cold, but I'm cold. Do they not have any sort of jackets in Gerudo Town? Or are they just so muscular that it just doesn't matter to them? God, I wish I could be just as massive and muscular as Gerudo women. Oops. Better go, girl. Mini Mulduga. Across the lands. Scattered about. The Gerudo Desert. Ooh, she went a flying and a hopping. Well, careful. Oh no. What do you mean? Oh no! I'm fucking right there. You're fucking joking. She did a little bunny hop! You're joking! Eh? Mm -hmm. Sister, you did not land upside down. Sister said, no adventure, please. Rude. Honestly, I should just lead her straight into Mulduga. See how she feels about that. Huh? It's 
spiral ruins. Interesting. I like how she comments on. Oh shit. Hi. Ah, a sinkhole. Yeah. I. Uh, yeah. My bad, sister. Okay, we'll go down slower so she doesn't bitch and moan. So I don't have to do this again. She can just read the books on the bookcase shield that I have on my back. Hey, stop there. Whoa. Hey, look at that. Huge statues. They're facing each. Mm -hmm. Huh? This is another statue, right? It's fallen over, though. Mm -hmm. I'm sure this is the place I was asked to investigate. Eh? Now that I'm here, I can really start my investigation. And of course, I have to reward you for your help. <laughs> I can tell right away that this place will be worth a really thorough look. Got my work cut out for me. It's already interesting. Rotana said these were supposed to be ruins of the seven heroines here. So we have the other two gone. Hmm. The other two. Where have you been all my life? They probably sunk it into the sinkhole. Mama. Wait, what? Why did it? Oh, book sand sinkhole. No, I don't. I want. I don't know why the big sword doesn't count for that guy who wants a picture. It's very rude of them. I was trying to run and then Link turned around. Is this sword not big enough for you? Uh, you think they're talking about this big sword here? In Elden? The Master Sword? I know what I must do! Sorry, is that rude? Can I take pictures while I'm floating in midair or no? I mean, there's an island over here. I could possibly do it. Lovely birds. Where's that sword? The sword that sees the darkness! Does that not count? It's a sword. I would like a large sword to put in my stable. That one does not count. Uh, should I go bowling? I'm like, is there a quick way for me to go bowling over there? It's a bowling hill. Maybe I'll jump from here. Bowling, 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 keep those prices rolling. <laughs> that is an old theme from... 
a a Walmart commercial where they roll back prices. <laughs> I feel like I should apologize for bringing that back to the forefront of me mind. Did they not give me a rock up here? How am I supposed to roll things down? Huh. No snowballs? away. Actually, let me just double check with this to see if there's nothing that I can use to roll down. But I don't see anything. So is this a cave hole? Like, Oh no, it's quite the opposite. I'm supposed to put something out of it and put into this little golfing thing. Yeah, I guess I I tend to look out for holes. I am nothing if not a predictable gay man. Wow. They really don't want me to put in it on there from down here. You must be this tall to place the stone in the Korok tree tray thing. Not a bowling hole. Unbelievable. Why did I put this here? Does that mean it's a cave? Yeah, usually when I mark something like this, it means there's a cave nearby because I, I, I probably did it while there was a cherry blossom tree that I activated. I mean, it could be further down, but I have my reservations that it's further down. And now it's raining. It did rain briefly. All right, I think I'll make my way to Kaka Rico from where? Let's go on foot ish. Can't wait for them to be like, oh, so you're telling me Princess Zelda was a fake and was being puppeted by the Demon King? Demon King. Secret stones? Literally, that's all they can say in, in the game. Uh... 
I was gonna say the fuck, but we know how to do these already. Put the thing under water. It shall pop out because of buoyancy. But of course. All right, I, I need my friends to sleep. I need a cute outfit. We need to slay. I don't know about the headdress though. We'll leave the headdress on. I mean, isn't that just cool? I haven't talked to this person yet. Oh my, you're quite the assertive Vogue coming and talking to me all of a sudden. Did you know that when a Gerudo comes of age, she goes on a journey to search for the Vogue of her destiny? I'm in the middle of such a Vogue hunt, and I believe you and I meeting here may have been fated. Don't you think so? Eh. Oh dear, apologies, I was only joking. You're too short for me. I don't think the Vogue of my destiny will make himself so easy to find, but thank you for the entertainment. Put a smile on my face. Oh. She don't like me. She thinks I'm a little man. With a little plan. Okay. Cool wall. Is this a real human? Or somebody who's gonna beat me up? Oh yeah, real human. Real Gerudo, do you think there is a tunnel under Ocean Boulevard? Or at least a, a Korok down here? I need fire. And I need to cook. Let's see, shall we? Where's my wheat? I would like to make own pizza. Ah, oh, I have no cheese! This is hell. Bum, 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 bum. Look at the floating toasty shroomy. As is tradition. You think they put another one under here? It's quite an expansive bridge. I think the... The infrastructure plan that Biden put in could be of some use to these people. Do I have a weapon? Yes. Haha! -ha. Excuse me. Three barren trees? With a banana? Hmm. I'm suspicious. Time to burn the banana.
Why you? How dare you do that to my bananas? Find them, this is for Master Koga. Ha <laughs> <laughs> uh, here. Do I have any muddle buddies? Enjoy. Oh shit. Um. <laughs> Didn't I just make a skewer? Sir? Bouncy. Oh, they don't bounce very far, do they? Ow. Ow. Hi, sister. Oh, maybe I should parry his ass instead of uh, tanking the hit. Get got. All of you. Get gotten, forgotten, begotten. <laughs> I can't believe they disguise themselves as trees. That sounds a little treasonous, no? Are you a real traveler? Yep. Good lord. -a. Oh, is it is nice to walk and look around. It really is quite nice. Nadra? No, I need a Dinral Claw. It's like a wannabe cave. Kinda cute. I don't see anything suspicious there to investigate if there is a coal rock. Have I taken a picture of her yet? <laughs> ah, he needs support. I'll help. Is she actually low enough for me? Oh. No. She shouldn't lean slight off. Give me your balls. Mm. <laughs> Thank you for your balls. 
I still haven't used a sleepover ticket. I just collect pony points and redeem them, and I don't use any, like, barely any of the services. I am not thankful. I am ungrateful. Like, she's over there. Like, I could claw her. Um, that's not quite where I was hoping it would fall. Oops, I don't have any of people. I'm poor. If I had an Android device, I'd- Ooh, she's going down a hole, isn't she? I need a best friend. I need it. I need the claw. Adra, please. A bubble frog I haven't gotten. Do you have a Gerudo bow? Christ, I can't fucking see. Sister. No. Sister! Uh-oh. Um. It bounced somewhere. I have to find it. Girl, I don't want to be cold. Stop. With chill out. Is it down here? Did it bounce down here? Yeah, it did. The claw. Okay. Back up here. I, I ended up teleporting here anyways. In she goes. What's at this one? Fan stabilizers balloon. I'm like, do they have any new dialogue? Oh, I don't see anybody here. She's running away because it's night time. Lady, what's next? What is it? If you'll excuse me, I have to check on the Sunderlion. It's a new species of plant. The first one found on the ruins that fell from the sky. Okay. The slower I go, the less frame rate drops there are because the game isn't thrashing memory to load stuff in because this game has no loading between areas. Hi. Well, look who's here. 
I'm gonna rest, but Enchanted's still open, so you have time to shop. Are they not here? Yeah. Good evening, Link. No matter how often I see it, it's still a magnificent sight. That stone tablet at Lookout Landing touched all this off. I've deciphered so many engravings and been treated to so many epic poems since then. Couldn't have done any of it without you, Link. Ooh. I intend to thoroughly research what chamber this Chamberlain hoped to convey in these ancient tablets. And if you want to reread them, please come back and see me. That right. Daddy? Oh. Master Link, good evening. Oh. Are you thinking about the floating ring ruin? I am as well. It's been on our minds for some time. Mm. We would like to just suggest resuming the research, if we may. Have you since figured out what became of Princess Zelda? <laughs> what? The Zelda who appeared after the upheaval was a creation of the Demon King? And the real Princess Zelda still hasn't been found? But how can this be true? Mm. It's such an unbelievable tale, and yet I trust you completely, Master Link. It must be as you say. It's hard to explain, but, but the princess we saw was somehow um, unfamiliar. It was uh, though her very aura was different. Mm -hmm. But if she was an imposter the whole time, that would mean... The real reason she ordered us to close off the floating ring ruin was because the Demon King saw it as a threat, isn't that right? That only means one thing. We should investigate the floating ring ruin immediately. Yeah. Mm. You're exactly right. There's no longer any reason to prohibit your research. Let's open up the floating ring ruin at once, Mr. Toro. Uh. Knowledge is tugging on the line. I'm tugging on his... Time to reel in some results. <laughs> Your laurel and phrasing is coming through, Mr. Toro. You really must be pleased. Aww. It's uh, just, um, there's one problem. We need to con We still need to determine how to conduct the survey. Ooh. It's clear that the interior of this ring ruin is hollow. Sadly, there doesn't seem to be an entrance. If the contents of the other ring runes are any indication, there should be a stone slab and slide inside engraved with Zonai script. Mm. First, we should look for a way to confirm that there is a stone slab inside. However, we don't want to damage these precious oh. ruins. Oh, pardon me, I was lost and thought I'd better hurry and tell everyone about this so we can open up the ruins. Yeah. The secret of the ring ruins. Mm. All right, I can finally start my research on the floating ring ruin. If I manage to make a new discovery, soon the day will come when everyone looks up to me, eyes full of adoration. Hmm. Oh. Yes, what is it? I'm busy, but I suppose I can indulge in a moment of idle chatter. I certainly won't have time for it once I've uncovered the secret of the ring ruins. I'll be the most in-demand scholar in the world. Imagine oh. it. Dr. Callop. Chasing clout. Ooh. Honestly, I was taken aback when I heard that Princess Zelda was an imposter. That's a lot to swallow, you know. What else is a lot to swallow, Toro? But I'm glad I can finally start my long cherished research on the floating ring ruin. Mm. Still, my hook's baited now, and I'm not letting go until I get to bite. Same. Uh? Oh, I neglected to tell you this earlier, Master Link. I've taken over the title of chief from my grandmother. Naturally, I still have a long way to go before I truly earn that title, but I intend to follow that path from first step to last. Mm. Finding out that the Princess Zelda I met with was a pawn of the Demon King. How to put this to words? Let's just say it's thrown me off my balance. It's so hard to believe. And yet I do believe you, Master Link. I could not bring myself to doubt you for even a moment. And if these ruins pose some kind of a threat to the Demon King, then we must accelerate our research at all cost. Mm. However, looking inside without damaging them is a difficult hurdle, one well beyond my understanding. Please, Master Link, lend your wisdom to Master Tor, and with your help, I'm certain a way forward will be revealed. Okay. I'll do my best. And use a ladder. 
Uh, can I wear different clothes? It's like they purposely forced me to use this. Look at them staring at me. Little do they know, I have the power. Oh shit. <laughs> to leap great distances. You know, I kind of don't want to go inside inside, but I think the game is going to force me to go inside inside. Going up. Yeah, I want to be on top. From the top, make it drop. That's a wop. Look, they can creep inside from here. I guess they'll need a photo, won't they? Alright. Shall I get a photo for them? It's, uh, it's sideways. <laughs> Let me destroy it. Are they on this side or this side? They're on this side, huh? He didn't just... Did he? It looked like he disappeared into the ring. That can't be right. Forget what I said. I must have imagined it. Mm -hmm. What's this you've got? Is that a... Sand seal plushie on a sword? Could it really be? <gasps> Paya! Caleb! Look at this! Hmm. No. If I rotate it a little bit, I could read this ancient Hyrulean text, Zonai script. Could this be the interior of the floating ring ruin? Well, the stone slab is so clearly visible. <gasps> There appears to be Zonai inscriptions on this one as well, just like in the other ring ruins, Toro, if you would. Uh... Right, let me see what I can decipher. Promise, Zelda. Solemnly signed, Minoru, Sage of Hide the Key. Southeast, Entrust, Future, Wish, Death, Defeat, Demon King. That's all I can make out. There's some lettering I can't figure out before Southeast, but Minoru seems to be someone's name. No. Hmm. At the context of Minoru. I do believe this is the first time one of these slabs have put a name to a shage. It also mentions Zelda and Demon King. How fascinating. <laughs> the inscriptions are telling us all sorts of essential information. Mm -hmm. What's the matter? Mm -hmm. uh, it's nothing, just the part before Southeast section. I think it says Dragonland. Mm -hmm. mm. oh. oh, you're right! Paya knows her stuff. This should be read as Dragon Land Southeast. Fantastic work, Paya. Oh, thank goodness I've proven myself useful. It seems my continued Zonai language studies have paid off. Oh no, I'm being upstaged. Um, where were we? Something about the Dragon Land to the Southeast? Mm -hmm. hmm. How familiar are you with Southeast Hyrule? There's a site in Farron that has long been known as the Zonai Ruins. It predates the ruins falling from the sky and is home to many ancient relics. If memory serves, there were dragon designs on those ruins that I haven't seen anywhere else. <laughs> hmm. 
Callop, great catch. The Zonai ruins in Farron. There's a good chance that's exactly where this is pointing us at. Mm. That's our Callop. Fantastic work. I, I, what did you just say? That inscription is pointing us towards Farron Zonai ruins. Aww. No, 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 not that. The next bit. A certain adjective was used. I believe it started with fan and ended with tastic. What was it again? Fantastic work, you mean? <laughs> yes, fantastic work. That's what you said. <laughs> yes. Gallop, what fantastic work you said. Huh. Fantastic. Me? Ooh. Link, when we put together the script on the stone slab and translate it, we get definite mentions of the sage Minoru, the demon king, and someone with the same name as Princess Zelda. Something related to all three of them must be waiting at the Zonai Ruins in Southeast Hyrule. Uh. We've landed a real catch here! Thank you for your help, truly. Now, we've no time to dawdle. There's research to be done. <laughs> Catap, will you join me? <laughs> well, of course I would be a... Ahem, fantastic addition to the team. Mm. Very good. With that settled, let's be off to the Zonai Ruins in Farron. First, we head southwest. First, we'll establish a base in Poplar Foothills at the Skyview Tower by the ruins. In search of new discoveries, we make for friend. Can I just ignore them? And just go from the Sky Island? They just left. Just like that. Well, I'm sure those two will be fine. Study more about the Zonai civilization so I don't fall behind to our own Caleb. Yet it seems somewhat frivolous next to the mystery of the real Princess Zelda's whereabouts. I don't doubt that she is safe and well, I must believe that. As chief of this village, I can't leave my people, so I must place the search in your capable hands. I pray that Princess Zelda will return to us soon. Yeah, I'm skipping that shit. <laughs> We're, we're gonna do a little... What's it called? Sequence breaking? I'm sure this is not the order, but... I've accidentally been here and activated this... Sh this headband thing that I must put on a glider and send it down. Minoru's theme. Well, I guess I'll put it down on something. You know, theoretically, I could just oh, drop it. You know what? Let me put it down and see where it points to. I'm very curious. It points to... Huh. Tobio's Hollow. I don't think I've been here. Yeah, no, I've totally ignored it. 100%. Have not been there. Um... Can't see shit. I mean, they give me stuff. So can I just plop a couple fans down? You know, I probably don't need a cart. And auto build. Oh no, 
I need another fan for that. Do they really not want to let me use this wing? Oh, I had to rotate it? <sighs> no. It's very dark. I can't see. Is that good enough? <sighs> the answer seems to be no. Oh, we're 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 just going in the clouds because can't see nothing. Oh. 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 I, I didn't realize they were going to have me dodge some sky islands on the way out. So what is in this little hollow region? It looks like some sort of bird shrine. Bonk. <laughs> My plane is just chilling. Look at Link hold up that thing. It's like a stethoscope looking thing. Is this the entrance to a whole temple? Huh. Is this right where the, the construct factory is? Let me look at my map. Yep. It's right where the construct factory is. I'll come back. I'm gonna go say hi to uh, these boys. Uh, but first, let me put down a teleport point. Is there another one I have? Yeah. Collect that one. And let's go say to hi to the boys over here. Cause uh, I I would I would like to see those ruins. Where are all those boys? They've set up camp. It's late. Yeah. Ah, so you're here. Came to learn about the Zonai from an expert, I gather. Welcome you to our humble base of operations. Behold, this is where the real investigation starts. It might not seem like much next to that Skyview Tower, I'll concede. Yeah. Ooh. Going forward, our research will... Are we'll proceed from here. Tar's already gone off to the ruins. If memory serves, he spoke of starting his investigation around the lake. Don't know exact his whereabouts, but if you go southeast, you should find the Zonai ruins he volunteered to inspect. And that said, huh, it's night now and he hasn't returned, which is worrying. Did he get swept up in his work at the site? God, that man is absolutely in de 
indefatigable. Indefatigable? Indefatigable. Can I just so, go say hi to Kilton? I'm gonna go say hi to Kilton. Cause I haven't talked to him at all this entire game. I need to give him like 800 bubble froggies, bubble, bubble gems. Hi, Jag. This weekend, I went to a dive bar to listen to my friend's cover band. And it was a lot of fun. The music they played was pretty solid. They were all and all very good musicians. That was a quite a positive experience to have. Uh, hopefully he doesn't leave before it's too late. I haven't talked to him at all. Ah, greetings and good meetings. I trade treasure for bubble jumps. Oh, you're the nice traveler from before. You gave me your bubble jumps. So kind. I mean, thanks. You know, it was a very special moment for me. Yes, very special. And I need more bubble gems. I must have more. I'm sorry. Ever since we parted, I've been traveling far and wide, and yet I still haven't gathered a single bubble gem. I have like 900. When will I become a Satori? What am I to do? It can't be a coincidence we meet again, traveler. Fate. Yes. Fate brought us back together, I'm sure of it. <laughs> Please, if you could get fingers on any more bubble chips, would you give them to me? I promise you suitable treasures in exchange for them. For example, look up there. The mystic clothing. Oh, there is yours if you bring me lots and lots of bubble gems. Yes, then if you get your fingers on any bubble gems, bring them to me. I'll be traveling far and wide in search of them. So if you spot my solid eye, don't be shy and come by. Oh yes, I forgot to mention something important. I believe gobbling down many at once is the key to turning into a Satori. So in the future, please bring me the quantity I ask for altogether. The reward I give you will be based on how many gems you give me. A good deal for both of us. Ah, let's trade! If you give me two, I'll give you one item of value. Eh. Yes, I have not talked to him this entire time. 84. I told you when I said I had 900, I was a mag order of magnitude off, but I was not joking. Thank you for the Moblin mask. He's about to shit bubble gems like he's never shat before. Get the laxatives ready. Yeah, I, he's gonna give me toenails in exchange for gems when I want these fucking clothes up here. Give me the clothes! Yes! Clothing. Eat it. Eat it. Mmm, yummy, 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 make a bummy, eat it. Rupee padding? It protects the wearer, allowing them to lose rupees instead of health? That's hilarious. Eyeballs. Uh, the the protection of capitalism like the, the the people in the submersibles it did not save them uh, not one bit <laughs> so 
So many different enemy masks. Ocean Gate wasn't wearing the right armor. I mean, that's how they imploded. They decided to not use titanium and use a different material. We're gonna be here for a while. Yes, those pants! The sandals? The shoes? You didn't know shit about deep sea submersibles. You weren't really clear on how deep. And it turns out the deepest point was reached a long time ago. Yeah, this is just for like, tourism. Like, people have done this successfully and safely without imploding. But no, people don't understand what tons and tons and tons of atmospheric pressure on one single body will do. What is this? A white-maned Lionel mace horn. Looks like a claw. He's doing a lot of swallowing. An angry antler? Law. What the fuck is this nose thing? Is this supposed to be like one of the cave monsters? Horriblin. Big nose. A pro. I'm mashing B, but only at the appropriate time so I don't accidentally like leave the menu. Slap that big nose on your hole. You must be very pleased. Is that why Bert and Ernie are like... Basically gay lovers? The Lionel one is cute. Oh, definitely furries are into this. I'm going to run him out of gear in his shop. <laughs> Where did he get the Gliak horns? Look how beautiful the Satori hood with like the long mane. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. I'm putting it on right away. What a beautiful piece of clothing. I'm not dying it. But I, I could look at the options. Ah, I've eaten all these bubble gems and still haven't turned into a Satori. What if I need to eat all of them? Traveler, I promise this is the last thing I'll ask of you. Would you please, please collect all of the remaining ones? No, it's not right. I don't have a single treasure left to trade. I couldn't. I shouldn't ask such a favor of you. Though, you know, perhaps it's because of all the bubble gems I've galled to blow up, but I can sense the presence of each and every bubble frog across the vastness of Hyrule. I admit, of course, still don't know exactly where they are. There are 62 more caves out there! Hmm. Cavorting near Cora Lake Southwest. Christ on a motherfucking cracker. Hold up! Okay, the middle piece is kind of ugly. The pants are cute. Uh, I need to take off my shield. Huh. Let's look at the back without the shield. Ah, yes. That's it. Oh, I definitely have a plushy sword. You know damn right I'm going to have a fucking plushy sword. Plushy sword? <laughs> So what I meant by doing stuff out of order was that I wanted to just go straight down 
to guidance from ages past instead of following them in these ruins since I did locate things, but I don't know if I should go in and out or do one all at once. I'm just curious to see what the dialogue would be if I finish the whole mission to do the ruins. Okay. Like, pretend to do it in order, but it's not important. I'll experience the whole thing. Does Toro get to run around with me? Because if so, it's worth it. If he doesn't, I'm not sure. Look at the hair physics. Hello, big banana tree. He just sends me off. God damn it. Follow me. This, did he open a door down here? Because that was not open before. Dear Caleb, the influence of the upheaval has spread to the Zonai ruins. Do you see this pillar-shaped ruin in front of this tent? There shouldn't be artifacts of that kind around here. An anomaly, and there's more. The rubble at the base of the pillar opened, revealing a new way inside, a new discovery. Naturally, I'll be going inside to investigate shortly. Join me as soon as you can. Yeah, I don't remember this shaft being lit when... Well, you know what? I haven't really come out this far. I've just like gone in and out of the mouth, but I did not notice like this brightly lit... Uh, opening. Hole opening. Listen to this. The atmosphere inside here. It's like rather spectacular. Charge shirt. Oh, I want the whole Thunder outfit. When do I get that? Huh? What a, what a beautiful, beautiful nerd he is. Oh my god, really? Ah, uh, hide, baby. Okay, let's talk to him. Ah, you came! After all, I figured you would after you made that breakthrough at the Ring Ruins. But listen to this, I've already got a whopper of a discovery on my hook here. Here, look at this. <laughs> it's a Zonai mural, complete with intact text. The style is unmistakable. Something short of miraculous that it's still here and basically intact. Which, come to think of it, might be ascribable to the Zonai advanced technology. I've got a bit... A fair bit of knowledge of the script, so I just had to try at deciphering it, but some of it still eludes me. Aww. Maybe it's a poem or some kind of code? Here, I'll read it out loud so we can both get on the same page. The first part says, Where the electric gob hidden at the long neck dragon along the wide mouth forest. So, so, I can't read. The first part says, Where the electric garb hidden at the long necked dragons along the wide mouth forest serpent. What do you make of Forest Serpent and the dragons there? Mm -hmm. To me, it calls to mind the tall pillars found around these ruins designed to look like dragons. Forest Serpent, though, I haven't seen any designs like that. What am I missing? What other wide mouth Forest Serpent is there? Hmm, maybe the Forest Serpent bit does remind me of a song that compared the Drasku River to a Forest Dragon. But anyway, there's more to this code and I'll keep reading. Mm -hmm. Next it says, Offer a Zonai charge to the altar at the tail. Pretty sure I got that right, but I have no idea what that means. What in the world is a Zonai charge, and where in the world is a tail with an altar? If we can crack all the riddles in this code, I'm sure that even greater discoveries await us. Ah, it wants me to solve a riddle. Imagine him exploring my ass with the same determination as these ruins. 
<laughs> yes, I can. I mean, do I put on the clothes now? What? I don't feel like wearing it. I'll put it on when I, I offer that thing at the tail. Fuck off. Beat! Eh. You know what? Maybe I shouldn't be this close. Hey, hey bestie. Where's the big boy? Thank you. Is the last piece of clothing going to be at the end? Where I get the headpiece? I just have to make sure I... I notice all of the, the lights that shine throughout this neck area. I mean, it kind of cracks me up that they've put monsters all throughout here. I should just wear that headpiece that allows me to... Oh, nice. Oh, nice. How come I didn't drop rupees? Instead, I just got electrocuted and dropped nothing. <sighs> Why are there Zonai down here? Hi, bitches. Oh. You know what? I don't have this. Let me use this. Oh no, bouncy sword is gone. What the fuck? Did he unleash upon me? Laser him. He's not... He can charge forward like that?! That's absolutely heinous. Oh. Oops. What, I, why didn't I equip a sword? Oh, it dropped? Excuse me? You hear all that money just falling out? Okay, yeah, I cannot let the money drain. Look how much money is gone. I've lost a thousand. This is, this is a, to a, a horrible thing to, to wear. I thought it was gonna be like, ah, uh, here's like a rupee here, rupee there. No, it's taking a hundreds of rupees at a time. I had 4,600 rupees when I got this second outfit. They don't, they don't care. Nice.
Bring out a shield. Oh my god. He took that and he replaced his thing with that, which is, I would think, stupider. Oh my god, the level 4 asshole is so thick! I put a fan on this. Why did I put a fan on this? Why did you change it and put a splash fruit a, a weirdo? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Why does this dude have so much HP? It's nuts. You know what? Just die by your own hand. No. Fucking two-handed sword. <laughs> Why are they so strong? <clears throat> and we're back. Don't have to tell me twice. I must evade. I mean, there's another thing that's lit over here. I'll come back. Let me just open this treasure. Please. Can't believe the Thunder outfit was just hiding here the whole time. I just never decided to walk through this. Nice headdress. Oh. My stubbornness wants me to beat these assholes over here, though. Beat it. Beat it. No one wants to be defeated. Should I do death from above? There was this mystery hunt team whose team name was always Death From Above, but they also had like massive amounts of people on their team. Why am I being shot? Because it's raining? I'm gonna need that fairy later on, aren't I? Well, I killed that. Finally. All of these like big boys causing me so much pain. Like pain upon pain upon pain. 
because I guess the only time I decide to dodge is when I'm only one on one. Because my brain just is not functional. Like, period. Like, bump, dumb, dumb fucking anything I do. I want it. I guess that was the thing I dropped. Where does this go? Mask. So I don't have to fight them. Please. It's me. Hi. I'm one of your friends. It's me. Oh, look. Butterfly in the sky. I can go twice as high. Take a look. It's in a book. Oops. I want it. Oh, it's gone. Oh. Yeah. Where is the tail altar? Oh, it says Zonai Ruins? Oh, is this the tail? Oh, hey, he's he's spitting out of control. Were these like always Zonai ruins or no? Is this where I put on the outfit and offer a thing? Oh, by the 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 dragonfly. Sad. Time to don the regalia. Eh. Eh. Don't remember what it looks like. Green. Where are the clothes? Drop the thing! Go to the island you've already been to! That's cool. Oh, look, it opens up! <laughs> Ow! Ow! <laughs> Wait, now I kind of want to go up there and see what, what it is. Oh. Caleb, did you see that lightning struck that dragon pillar too? Huh? Is someone in those ruins? It's me. In a costume. It's you again. Uh, we think a terrible lightning strike hit here, but I'm glad to see you weren't hurt. Oh. 
Never seen lightning strike like that. And even stranger, the dragon statue seemed to glow just before it. Link, if you know what, anything about this, please fill us in on what happened. Unbelievable. A mechanism in the ancient ruins got rid of the thunderclouds and revealed some new sky islands. Mm. Great catch. And another, another amazing discovery in the books. In fact, I'd say it's <laughs> the hall of the century. It's a significant discovery to be sure. I'd like to go investigating further, but we have no way of getting up mm. there. Mm. You're right. That doesn't make it any less exciting, though. We need to report this to Pura right away. Mm. Caleb, I'm going back to Kakariko. I want to write up the recent events around the floating ring ruin in a report for Pura. You should stick around here to conduct a thorough investigation. Find out if there are any more discoveries to be made. <gasps> what? Remain here? You mean alone? <gasps> yeah. If we can't get up to the sky, there's so much to discover on land. It's our duty to unravel it all. You can do this, Callop! Uh. He wants me to investigate alone. Fieldwork isn't my strongest suit, but this may be my chance to make a historic discovery. <laughs> Alright, so leave this to me, Tora. I'll begin preparing at once. I'll head back to our base of operations for a bit first. As for me, I think I'll go to the stable. Fleet. I'm supposed to take a picture at this bridge. Now that I've cleared up all the rain, now's the perfect time to do a little bit of Pokemon Snap. Is this not clear enough? Rude. Well. We just get to sit here. Look at the horn. Look at the whole island that I've been to accidentally already. I wonder what's like on the top side of it though. Like, it's just like a whole foundation under here. Uh, while I wait for this to clear up, I'm gonna go use the restroom. Everybody, please clap for me because I did work out today. What is, which is the false? That false, yeah, these are the false. Lots of false. Not clear enough. I can take a picture of his boulder breaker. Blue Hinox horn kind of looks like chains. Maybe that is what it's supposed to be. A Royal Claymore? 
What else is on his back? Did it not accept that as a boulder breaker the first time I took a picture of it, or what? Go. Bye bye. The bow it wanted? The fact that I have to take pictures of everything? Too much. All right, come on, three o'clock. You can go away now. Here, have fun over there. Hello, clouds. Bonk. Really? I have to wait till four? You like what his bare feet sounds like on this wood? I wonder what it sounds like if I change shoes. Like boots. See? Changes sounds. Do I have anything that looks like it would be metal? Eh. I'll go back to the outfit. Come on, clouds! It's almost there, it's almost there. Come on, you little slot machine. Yes. Clear day. Where's global warming when you need it? I just had to wait five minutes. I'm also kind of glad it hasn't been super hot in California as of late. And they finally fixed that gate that's outside of my window. So I don't hear it squeaking. You probably could hear it on my screen, my stream a couple times. You saw a report how Texas is melting. Yeah, and you know what else is a problem about Texas? That they have a, a grid that's not connected to the national grid. So, like, if if they can't do enough, they can't generate enough electricity. They don't have the ability to draw from the rest of the power grid. It's it's really silly. Like, California can negotiate with other states oh. and, and get some power. No. Uh -huh. It's not very clear, is it? Oh. That painting sound sounds like me earlier today. That actually looks really nice on the uh, wall. It's like the same timbre, hmm. not timbre, same color temperature as the rest of the space. What's my reward? Ooh. Tough tomato seafood soup. Oh. Wink, you save some points. Please head oh. to the counter. Thanks for a photo. Last year, when California had a, a spike in usage, they sent out a text message yeah. to get everybody to turn off their electricity, and they saved people from Ooh. going through rolling blackouts. Uh -huh. At that time, my my house inside was 90, like five degrees oh. inside, and so I just 
I just was naked in front of a fan. There was something that I wanted to explore, but it felt like it was a quest to me on the other side of here. Like, it felt like it was a, a, a ruins. Also, I need to see if the these Dondons, like, shit out some gold with the Luminous Stone I gave them. Okay, so we got a Sapphire, some Amber, uh, a Rupee, some Flint, some more Amber. I had some good digestive system they have. They're processing Luminous Stone into gems. Anyways, let me feed them. You know, it's faster if I just go in this menu. Consume. Do I have to watch them eat it or just leave it here and they'll... They'll get to it eventually. Okay. They're eating. And then over here, there was something at the end of this tr hollowed out tree trunk that I was like, this looks. Like ah! Bitch. I was telling a story. Ugh, over here, this is what I was talking about. It looked very cool. But it may have just been things that were laying down and not actually some kind of... ...temple-ish area. I mean, it leads to somewhere-ish? Like what? A hole in the ground? And a Korok puzzle? Yeah. Oh, I heard the Korok forest was all weird for a while there. But I guess now it's back to normal. That makes me happy, yay. So this was the Korok that was gonna tell me what to do? Like, why are th all these rocks down here? Excuse me? You know, I did not know they could hop out. Oh, I needed to take a picture of one of them. Please do not kill until I take a picture. Thank you. How did the Choo Choo not die to this boulder being on it? All right, there's some people in the ground. That's nice. Oh yeah, bombs hurt. Oh, that's just a draft. Mm. 
What? That's it? I was expecting like full on spelunking down here. Is this really nothing? Ugh. All right. Well, I'll just go back to where uh, we go down. Sage number five. Please tell me more about yourself, Sage number five. Hi, yes. I am the last Zonai remaining. I have the ability to separate my soul from my body. I like long walks on the beach, and my favorite drink is a whiskey sour. This is such sad music. Okay, cool. It's not... Uh, just like an elevator that goes straight down. Link. Zelda's chosen protector. You must hurry. We must meet as soon as possible. I like how Minoru's voice is super clear. Compared to all the other sages. And how this whole, like, chasm isn't covered in gloom. I'm glad they did a whole dungeon, two whole dungeons underground. I've already wildly explored this area. Pick it up. Please put this piece in the face of this artichoke. Oops. The same artichokes they use in Kingdom Hearts 2. Link, Zelda's chosen protector. My name is Minoru. I am the Sage of Spirit. We actually get a first name. I'm happy you have arrived. Like they didn't name the other sages. At last we can speak with each other. Unfortunately, I no longer have a body. Without a physical form, we cannot yet speak face to face. But do you see the four storehouses in the area? It's lit. Ooh, I like the voices going ha ha ha. I would ask you to visit each of them and assemble a body for me. This is my request to you, Link. Loyal How trippy. 
And then we're getting some chordal tonal music too. From the, the little percussion symbols. Eh, I'll just go to the one close to me. It's like similar to a dungeon, but like each of the, the areas is like its own little mini- Oh. Hi, friends. Yeah, I don't think I've been in this one yet. I don't think it's a named location on my my map. I just remember going into this place and the game being like, You may not enter! You are too gay. Which is true. I am. Like, when I tried to touch this, it was like, No. X. The fuck? It's really like a conveyor belt. Huh. What are all these wheels for? Okay, that's lit. It's just a pit for me to get confused by. Looks like some mycelium down there. <sighs> Does it want me to make my own? Like, wheel ramp, or what? You know, I could just... Put these things on? Oh. The fuck? Excuse me. You have no right to be moving without my command. Can I just make a three-wheeled vehicle and call it a day? No! Why does it turn on? You thought they could have used the underground more? Well, they didn't. Here, straddle this. Enjoy. Okay, never mind. Car, please. Oh shit. <laughs> uh, this wheel is kind of not correct. Just a little bit uh, strange. Can it straddle the thing now? Here, please straddle. It works. Play the music!
Am I supposed to just take it out for a ride? If you want to go and take a ride with me! Oh, there was one right there that I just ignored. Wait. You know what? Let's see what this ramp is like. Oh yeah, we're gonna fuck him up. Bum, 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 bum. Literally don't know what I'm supposed to do with this piece, by the way. Okay, I wasn't sure how it was going to break out that box or if I was supposed to do something with it. But they were like, you get to play Operation. This is a little different than, like, That's firing the terminals, the which is well. something that I can appreciate. <laughs> Left arm! Right arm, left leg, right leg, run away from the trees, I say. I like how Minoru's dungeon is all puzzles that have to do with Zonai devices. Pretty neat. Oh wow, this lake piece is kind of big. You don't need this anymore, do you? Cool. I supposed to attach it back? I could use this. Fuck. I thought I was gonna take out the weapon and not throw the bomb. I am a great magician.
You know what? I have a big wheel in my thing. I don't have to be crazy. I can just pop a, a big wheel. It's it's not a big deal. Up. Like, have I already done the puzzles in here? By accident? Because I was just, I was just randomly here and I was like, oh, why not? You think this treasure is still back here? Or is this just a, a lookout point for me to see what to do? So I know there are some treasures that I nabbed in here. Yeah, I guess they're not here. Look, it's already thick enough. Oh, it's not thick enough. Alright. I will... Rotate it. That's how we win. Enjoy! <laughs> My two-wheeled vehicle. It... It does stay. I like a lot more than I think it should. Literally link it on the ladder and jump. Ya hussy. One pull. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Excuse me. Like I don't know what these fan things do, but I'm I'm taking them. Like why spin? Like, can I make this thing... Like... Fly? Pulse. 
Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> I'm cracked out. Is this gonna work? No! Let's get it back on land. Uh oh. Uh oh. She don't like it. How bad is this going to be? Eh, not that bad. Um, this part's pretty bad though. Yeah, about that. You better swim, girl. I didn't even know there was like a whole waterway <laughs> to do anything like this in the game. Up, oh, and we're done. Thank you for your support. I need to see this thing get absolutely, like, evaporated when I leave it here. No? <laughs> I'm... I'm dumb. Oh, I'm very dumb. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> and I think I part. probably had that's it enough. correct and then I just messed up. Yeah, I'm avoiding fighting things. I, I am in a pacifist mood today. One, one we saw how fucking terrible I was at. At fighting earlier today. So we're not doing that again. They really want me to send, like, these things to space, don't they? Can I just grab this? I mean, that looks sufficient. You know, that way we have something to hold on to while we're going for a ride with my rocket power, of course. All 
All right. Thrusters at a hundred percent. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, why do I still have rockets on this? Why did the rockets not disappear? I mean, I could send it off by itself. Those beams have like some high frequency bullshit going on. I cannot summon here. Alright. Protect me. <laughs> Get fucked. Zonite? Link. You have no shoes. It's on a cart. Here, this is the other way I could do it. Rewind and walk under. Ah, Link, you done it again. Link, you're so cool. Link, will you have my children? Link, to Mars! Hey, look. Somehow I'm still able to steer with, like, the leftover kinetic energy. Why are the arms so big and the legs so, like, non-existent? Please. Uh oh. Uh oh. Just one more to go. One more left, Link. The body for my spirit is nearly complete. Link, I've been waiting a long time for you, Link. Link, why do you spend all day touching yourself when you need to be creating a body for myself, Link? They eat, they they're using a lot of synth for Minaru's themes in this like construct depot area. No, I'm not fighting anybody. Give me back her themes. Link, is that a huge shaft over there? Uh, maybe I do have to go up even higher. I mean... Don't I have, like, eyeballs I can send? Oh, these are the only eyeballs I have available. I like how they take fall damage. Oops. I sent a wing over here. And an eyeball that did not hit. Why 
Why is that lit? Is that the other depot? Oh, that's where I came out from, huh? You know, this whole time I didn't think I was going to be bringing like single pieces together. I thought I had to figure out how to get the factory to work again. The factory! Is it faster because I... Oh, oh, oh! 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 I probably only need one. But two would be more fun. Ah, shit. Forgot about that. I mean, I could just send it off and come back later. Go, have fun! Oh, I mean... Go, have fun! Look at it go. Look at her go. She's accomplishing so much all by herself. Oh, <laughs> Remember how I killed myself to a bomb flower? It's me. You wonder how I got here. <laughs> one turns on, the other one turns off. I shall lift this so it seems less heavy and look how much faster we ex- uh, Go- go up. Thank you. Good. Bum 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 bum. Where do I get the flying pieces from? I see. Look at that thing try to float up. The thing was like, with all due respect, thing, you must stop now. Uh, I kind of want to put this on top of the box. Up, oh, not there. Ugh. Only three. We don't need more than this. Excuse me? Good. Oh, I should probably put it on the... The ramp.
<laughs> I pick this ramp. I don't pick the other ramp. The other ramp is for gays. So, like, what else is in the whole depot area? Oops. Oops. Oh, it dropped. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's absolutely perfect. It did exactly what I needed it to do. Release yourself. Come on. Go in. I feel like she tripped out of it because she's like, I don't remember how to walk. Like, what if I had Mr. Robot Friend when I was fighting the Yiga clan, Master Koga at the end, you know? That would have been cute. Thank you, Link. Now only one task remains. We must recover my secret stone. Oh, I don't know if I can find your secret stone today. Sister, we are not finding it. Here. Please, Link. Let us go there together. I have to go play volleyball. And have the dinner. Path will be very dangerous. Fortunately, this construct body you have built for me is hardly helpless. There is a platform nearby where we can explore its potential. I like how her avatar is a literal body. Am I hopping on its back? Ride me, Link! Minoru's construct. I'm literally gonna ride Minoru. Remember how I, I put things like this in it? Well, let's test out her abilities. While I run around in a mech and go left hand, right hand, guard, back part, attach. Oh, oh, she can attach while I'm while I'm doing stuff on it. So, are you gonna teach me now, mm. uh, Link? The weapons here can draw forth the true power of this construct. Attach one to a hand and your power in combat will be magnified several fold. Uh -huh. The road to the secret stone is long and arduous. I recommend that you make stops along each armory along the way. Get accustomed to operating this construct so that you are prepared for whatever you may face. Attach things to the hands or the back. Attach objects can augment the constructs movements or combat abilities i like how there's like a built-in light metal plate on the back guard is x bonk Bonk. How do I unattach if I don't like it? Oh. So what happened to that metal plate? Is it gone forever? Okay, back part. Oh, so like if it comes behind me, I can just be like... Bzzz. That's so weird. I dismount? 
with the jump? Can Minoru jump? Bonk. It hurts Link directly. And so this uses my battery. Do I catch on fire? I mean, this game is struggling with all the fire that I have out. And my best friends that I have here. I don't get it. Is this for like running away or what? Okay, maybe not that. If attacking with like left and right is so weird. Because it's like you spend the whole game pressing Y and then all of a sudden you use the shoulder buttons to attack and then it's kind of just like negligible against these guys. Oh, you just punched it. Oh, I can still grab things from here. Come here. So, what happens if I, like, grab a bomb? It's dead. Fang, Zonite, Fang, Fang, Guts. What the fuck? All right, before I accidentally explode myself, let me save. And bonk. Huh? Is this like the equivalent of like a, a kaiju battle now? And ladies and gentlemen, that's what happens when you die on the back of a construct by hitting another construct with a bomb flower. And that does it for me today on my stream. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to go play volleyball tonight and have dinner so I don't feel like trash at volleyball tonight. I appreciate you spending your evening with me. I will see you guys tomorrow when I finish the rest of Minoru's quest.